Hello everyone, Showman Teen here. I'm making this quick video on how to update uh, a plugin on Cacti uh, and retain your settings and data of that plugin. So I'm going to be using uh, uh, the Threshold plugin as an example. So currently I have Threshold version 1.5.1 installed on my system and we see version 1.5.2 released. So I wanna update. Uh, so if I go over to my threshold tab, you'll see that I have a couple of uh, thresholds already in place, and I obviously want to keep those. Um, you'll see, you know, there's even data in the log. All this stuff uh, during the upgrade should all um, be retained if you follow these steps. So in the console, first thing I'm going to do is go to configuration and plugin. And then I'm going to disable the plugin. We're not going to uninstall the plugin by uh, clicking the uninstall, okay? Because once you hit the uninstall button, that will actually delete the tables out of the MySQL database. And along with that goes all of your data. So as you can see right now, <clears throat> the threshold tab is gone, okay? So I'm gonna go over to the GitHub page and now you can do one of two ways. You can, uh, I always like to do the release. So uh, this is a fairly new release. So I will just copy the tar.gz uh, file. You can also um, clone the latest repository doing a git clone of the uh, GitHub repository. Okay. <clears throat> so first thing I'll do is just a simple sudo wget of the new code. So I'll move the, uh, I, in the directory I'm in is var www.html cacti plugins. Um, if you've installed by package, sometimes it's user uh, cacti site. Uh, it all depends. So uh, it's your cacti directory and in the plugins folder. I'm going to move over the tholed directory temporarily. Okay, we'll just do dash old. I'll extract the tar file. Okay, we'll rename the file from plugin tholed to just tholed. Okay, throw sudo in front of that. I can remove the tar, I don't need it anymore. And then just be sure to put in the proper permissions. Okay. So in this case, I'm using Apache on Ubuntu. So it's default user is www, uh, uh, www data on, uh, on Red Hat. It would be like Apache, Apache. <clears throat> okay. Just double check that my, double check my work here. Okay, so I see threshold www data, just like the old directory. I'm going to go back into the GUI now. And if I refresh the page, I'll see okay, that there is the two cacti uh, directories. Okay, uh, sorry, uh, threshold directories. Okay, so the one that has the check that's ready to be installed. So right now, this one says plugin error, right? That's fine. That's just because the threshold uh, folder is not in the proper naming. That's a, the old version. And if I enable this now, you'll see that the current version I have is version 1.5.2. If I go over to threshold, I see that all my data is still intact. I can then go back to my server remove the threshold old folder and then go back to console plugins and you'll see that that old uh, entry or the second entry that said plugin error is gone now uh, and we're ready to go and so that's how you can update your plugins without losing any of your data on cacti have a good day